Hey guys, um, this is a quick follow-up review on the uh, Ultra Paradigm 4.5. Um, now, I did an initial review on these, um, telling you about the size, the feel, all the rest of it. Um, so you can go check that out. Uh, I'll link it in the description. This is mostly a uh, follow-up because uh, I'm going to be rotating these out of my usage. Um, and they haven't done a lot. They've done 153k, so nearly 100 miles, which is nothing. Now, um, in terms of wear and tear, they're fine. The outers are holding up fine for 100 miles. Nothing wrong. They haven't got a lot of tread on them, so they haven't actually got a lot of tread to lose in the first place. Um, so it's fine. Uh, they still have a decent amount of bounce. Uh, I'm still not thrilled with the support in uh, the stabilisation. I prefer a neutral shoe. I, uh, when I first, you, you can see in my old review, but um, when I first got these, I didn't realise they had so much stabilisation effect. Um, I have worn a orthotic in the past, so it didn't really bother me, but you know, I don't know why Ultra changed these to be a stabilisation shoe. Um, but the reason I got rid of, I'm going to be getting rid of these and rotating these out is because they are giving me, they've given me an injury um, repeatedly um, on my left foot. I don't know why, but uh, it only happens in these shoes, so I'm blaming the shoes at this point. Uh, it happens on my, my left foot, um, specifically on the top, uh, the, the tendon that goes to my uh, big toe. Um, when I run in these, and I'm not talking long distances, when I run in these six kilometers, seven kilometers, so th three and a half, four miles, something like that, um, it leaves me in, in pain, uh, even just walking, and I find that I can't lift my big toe up anymore. That tendon really hurts, um, and I have no idea why. As I say, I've done 150k in these, and up to about 140k, no problem at all. I did relatively long runs, up to 20k, nothing insane, but sort of 15k fairly often, 12k a lot, um, and they was always fine. but. Now they've started giving me problems, uh, and as I say, they're a knitted upper, so it's not like there's a pinch point that could happen. I've tried to loosen them, loosen them way off to the point where they're, you know, they're super crazy loose, but they still have this problem. I've tried tightening them up, they still have it. I've tried a few different lacing strategies. That might help, I don't know. Um, it, it didn't seem to help that much when I tried it. Uh, I only tried a few different patterns, but realistically, um, I don't want to mess around with lacing patterns to stop being injured. I'm just going to get another shoe. Um, so that is disappointing. I don't really know why that is. It might be the the uh, stabilisation orthotic on them, but yeah, I don't know. So uh, if you do get these, beware that may be an issue for you. Um, I've never had a problem like that before with a shoe. Um, it is kind of disappointing because the Paradigm 3 was my favourite road shoe of all time. Um, if, they may, if they bring out a new Paradigm, which is super maximal, doesn't have that stabilisation, it's neutral, and it's not this stupid knitted top, it's like a, a proper uh, mesh top, then I will most likely buy them again, but in the meantime, uh, I'm going to be moving away from Ultra Shoes for, for Road, which is a bit unfortunate. And that's where we're at, just so you know.